A group of local immigration lawyers and community members are coming together in light of President Trump's executive orders. They say they want to bring awareness to current issues and speak out about their concerns. CBS 4's Nora Salinas met with them earlier tonight. And Nora, what can you tell us about this group? Well, Eddie, this group is made up of mostly women from the Lower Valley, and they want to serve as a voice for the community and for those who may not be able to speak for themselves. What we have started is a grassroots movement. Valley women of all ages and backgrounds are coming together. Some are attorneys, uh, physicians, homemakers. Their goal to let their voices and concerns be heard about changes in laws made in the past few weeks. Each of us as an individual felt a need to raise our voice and some of us have been activists and lobbyists for years and some of us it's a very new experience for us. The group made up of almost 20 members including former director of Planned Parenthood Rosemary Herman say they were inspired to create a local activist organization during the women's marches in Brownsville and Austin. We are looking at the immigration ban, we're looking at the changes in the health care law, etc. It's going to affect ultimately everyone in the country. It's our goal and, and hope that by educating um, others, not just about ideological differences, but in general, we'll be able to create a more informed public so that we can be all politically engaged. Immigration attorney Jody Goodwin says she believes President Trump's recent executive actions have brought questions and confusion to many Valley residents. Many phone, uh, phone calls, emails, um, individuals just stopping by. Um, it, it is very concerning. The group hopes to help people who may have questions about changes in laws and speak up to local representatives to create changes in government. They can go to their senators, they can go to their representatives, they can go to the, to the White House and they can let people know what they think needs to be done, uh, possibly instead of what is coming down the road. And this group has already written to local representatives and hope to grow their organization. For more information, you can visit our website. In the studio, Nora Salinas, CBS4News and ValleyCentral.com.